It's Go Go Media Girl, and I'm at Stiletto TV with um, Molly. Yeah, you got it right this okay. time. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, what do you do here? At well, I produce a couple of programs, and I present a show called Lifestyle Zero One One. What's that? It's an entertainment magazine show. Basically, we go around featuring people's gigs and events, and we interview socialites. We also do brand management, and we feature people's houses and so forth. So yeah. What's a magazine show? A magazine show is a show that is normally based on featuring events that you would normally find on hard copy, but we make it through documentary version. So what you'd see in a magazine, we shoot it and we put it on television. Oh, okay. Yeah. Cool. What's the brand management? Yeah, what's brand management? Brand management is, for example, let's say a company or a certain artist is launching out themselves. We are going to feature that artist or that brand on our show, developing their brand. Mm -hmm. It's kind of brand management. Mm -hmm. Can you, like, talk about it more? Because I don't okay. really understand that. Sure. So let's say you're Z, right? Mm -hmm. So you want to launch out GoGo -Go and you want to make it bigger on a broader scale. You call Lifestyle 011 to come and host some of your networking gigs, right? Mm -hmm. Like uh, maybe you have a networking gig at Soweto or wherever. And then we come there, we feature your gig, and then we put it on the show to help your brand grow bigger. Oh, I get it now. Okay. Yeah. Um, so anything else you'd buy? Except for um, that isn't brand management? Well, most, I would say the show is mostly focused on events. Eh? But the show I produce is uh, as a new show. It's relatively a new show here at Sir TV. It's going to be called Josie Creed's. Josie Creed's is totally different to, um, to Lifestyle 011. I would compare Lifestyle 011 to a collaboration of, and I'm not, I'm not saying it's the same, but if, you were, if I were to describe it to a person who didn't know it, I would say there's a show here in uh, South Africa. It's called Top Billing and uh, Silly Matoons. So it's kind of a combination of both but we try to make it uh, as, as, as simple as possible without the fancy stuff so that's what lifestyle zero one on is Josie Queens is like um, a fashion meets street culture type of wise so we go around featuring bands live bands we go around featuring artists whether you uh, your art has been uh, reviewed in a gallery or if it's just street art and we also go around to many other organizations that deal with fashion related stuff so that's what Josie Creeds does yeah. Yeah, what's a producer? A producer is someone who composes the content that you see in a television program. So what's your favorite television program, Z? Any. <laughs> Any. Any. Come on now. <laughs> Jesse? Jesse. So on Jesse, you know that Jesse doesn't do all of the work, right? She's probably just the front line of the show. There's a producer, there's a content writer, there's a script writer, and there's all those people that put everything together so that you could see Jesse on television. So a producer is someone that takes all of that, the script, sit down with the director, the director gives it a visual aspect, like how it's going to look. A producer brings all of these guys together and they take that content and they make it, it's like, it's like a, a, a blueprint of the show. They create that blueprint the producer creates the blueprint for the show basically putting all of this stuff together and then the person the producer and the director give it a visual aspect so guys like you could watch Jesse cool. yeah. yeah what skills do you need when you're um, doing the producing and brand marketing and stuff well, I would advise you to go to certain schools that deal with media-related stuff. Uh, and there's a lot of them, actually, and I'm sure there's some in South Africa as well. So any schools that are relatively related to media and television and programming, television programming, that is. So, yeah. What school skills, like math and reading and writing? I did math in high school. I haven't done a stench of math since I've been here. But yeah, you, can, you keep to your basics and then when you get to your tertiary level, that's when you're going to select your core uh, subjects that will lead you to become what you want to be in terms of production and so forth. Okay. Yeah. What tips would you give somebody um, about what you do? They want to be it too. 
um, believe in it, even when nobody else doesn't. So it's it's a, it's a, it's a hard industry to crack it, and I'm, I'm very happy actually that Soweto TV gave me the opportunity to work here. Uh, but I would I would say Soweto TV for many people has been a stepping stone. You know, a, a lot of people started here and moved on up. So I'm happy that uh, they granted me the opportunity to work here. So just keep at it and keep pushing. It won't be easy, but I don't think anything that's worth it is ever easy. Well, that was Mbali from Soweto TV and, and, and Go Go Media. And Go Go Media Girl.